Impressionism is a 19th century artistic movement that throughout the conventional academic Debo arts that is considered the authority in realistic art styles. Impressionism rubbed off on other art forms such as literature and photography. This movement came around when a group of artists decided to do the unconventional and represent modern people in their paintings. Through its use of biased landscapes and lighter brush strokes, Impressionism became one of the most influential artistic movements for the modern world. What started it all was a group of artists that opened their own exhibition in protest against the Salon of France, an important museum that decided who was successful as an artist. Claude Monet, Pierre-Auguste Renoir, Berthe Morisot, a female artist, Paul Cézanne, Edgar Degas, and Alfred Sisley were the founders of the Impressionist movement. Although the show itself was unsuccessful, the reaction towards their works was not altogether atrocious. A few of the critics enjoyed their works, calling it a fresh approach to painting and wrote reviews in their favor. Even though they were mostly criticized for their work, the Impressionists were not thrown off their course. They took their love of art and unique styles, for example, blurred portraits and depictions of modern life, and turned it into a protest against the norm, even if it was insulting to the art world. In the beginnings of their careers, they befriended patrons who bought most of their work and promoted them across the world. One of their most important patrons was Paul Durant Rule, who helped their works of art become high-quality pieces in America. As people, the Impressionists were very assorted in their beliefs, lifestyles, religions, and even painting styles. But what they share is a desire for a fresh new way of looking at things, which was inspired by their fascination in the photographic process. Claude Monet saw how the shutter mode in a photo made blurred images, which he tried to recreate in his paintings. Camille Pissarro also tried to recreate the blurred effect, which influenced his painting Le Pont Neuf, which a critic wrote that the tiny figures looked like black tongue licking. Impressionists throughout the use of black and white, using only primary and secondary colors. They used only those colors to make their nature and portraits look more natural, like a photo, by using lighter brush strokes to overlay colors. They used complementary colors, which are opposite colors on the color wheel, and show that there is life beyond the frame like in the ballet scene by Degas, and before the performance also by Degas. In the end, Impressionism is one of the most influential art movements for 20th and 21st century art because it was the top movement to go against what was considered artistic. Impressionism was the first movement that threw out the conventional historical, biblical, and mythological art for more modern everyday art. As said by Francesco Salvi, a known architect in the 1980s, Impressionism is at the root of all modern art, because it was the first movement that managed to free itself from preconceived ideas, and because it changed not only the way life was depicted but the way life was seen. In my opinion, Impressionism is one of the most influential art movements for contemporary art because of its use of unconventional ideas such as recreating modern life during this time through their use of lighter brush strokes and depictions of biased landscapes.